Well, there are less than two weeks, of course, to Election Day, and with time running short now, the candidates remain laser focused on the battleground states. And there's also a new controversy on the campaign trail. Jared Hill looking into that for us. Former President Donald Trump was back in the Tar Heel State Tuesday for the second day in a row, slamming Vice President Kamala Harris. She's totally unfit for office. And the retired generals who served in his administration. What a stupid group of people they were. An article published by The Atlantic yesterday claimed that during a private conversation while in office, Trump said, quote, I need the kind of generals Hitler had, people who were totally loyal to him, which the Trump campaign has denied. As a 24-year veteran of our military, that makes me sick as hell. Harris's running mate, Tim Walls, reacted to the alleged Hitler comment while stumping in Wisconsin yesterday. Earlier, former President Barack Obama joined him on the trail before Obama rallied solo in Detroit, introduced by rapper Eminem. We have a chance to choose a new generation of leadership in this country. Harris traded the campaign stage for sit-down interviews, telling NBC News she won't compromise on abortion rights. I don't think we should be making concessions when we're talking about a fundamental freedom to make decisions about your own body. Harris also said she and her team are ready should Trump prematurely declare victory on election night. Jared Hill, CBS News. Trump campaigns in battleground Georgia, while Harris will head to Pennsylvania for a televised town hall.